a ship of 11,000 ton km uh, 7.4 meter kg 6 meter is listed 4 degree to port a heavy lift weighing 150 ton is to be discharged from number 3 lower hole using ship's a jumbo derrick whose head is a 23 meter so this is the vessel and the head is 23 meter from keel this one is port side and let me mark here port side and this one is a starboard side the cog of the weight is a 3 meter above the keel that means from here this one this distance is 3 meter and 5 meter to the port of the center line well this distance is uh, 5 meter find the list as soon as the derrick lifts the load and so on there are various stages so let's focus on this stage one as soon as the derrick lifts the load well first of all the ship is already listed so we need to find initial list movement ilm which is given by this formula w into gm into 10 theta so w is 11000 and gm is the difference of a 7.4 and 6 which is 1.4 into 10 is 4 degree I get this value 1076.9 ton meter and that is on the port side because vessel is listed towards port now as soon as the derrick picks up the load let's talk about stage 1 the weight is hanging by the derrick and suppose this is the uh, derrick here and derrick has picked up the load as soon as the derrick picks up the load like this what will happen well it will behave as this with this weight is instead of uh, this 3 meter weight is uh, shifted to this location weight is moved like this it is going to behave like that so uh, let's work out uh, what will be the gg1 well gg1 can be calculated by this formula gg1 is equal to w into d divided by wf where w is the weight uh, shifted and d is uh, the distance shifted which is kg of the initial position on kg of the final position that is the uh, distance or the difference or simply uh, distance uh, uh, shifted so in case here this initially it is a uh, 3 meter kg1 is uh, 3 meter and kg2 is uh, 23 meter so the difference is 20 meter so this is going to be 20 meter and WF which is the final weight is equal to the initial weight because it is uh, a sh uh, it is the case of a shifting only we didn't load or discharge anything well now using this information gg1 is uh, 150 into uh, 23 minus 3 which is uh, 20 meter divided by 11000 so I get this value 0 0.273 meter it should be noted uh, let me use this color suppose G was here and weight is shifted upward so GG1 will also shift upward GG1 will shift upward the value of KG1 will be KG plus GG1 and KG is given which is 6 plus uh, 0.273 this is uh, 6.273 meter now km is given in the problem which is 7.4 meter so I will write the value of km which is uh, 7.4 meter the difference of the two 
as the GM or I can write new GM. The difference of the two is uh, a GM which is uh, let me just uh, punch in the Kelsey 7.4 minus 6.273 which is uh, 1.127 meter. This is the GM. Now let's work out what is the initial list moment. Initial list moment we have already worked out but in the stage one assume that weight is just here itself just lifted just lifted that means the list moment cause is zero so initial list moment was uh, 1076.9 ton meter port and list moment cause is zero so the final list moment final uh, list moment will be 1076.9 ton meter towards port well now easily we can calculate list 10 theta is equal to final list moment divided by wf into gmf everything is final here so we'll put the value which is 1076.9 divided by wf and weight hasn't changed so this will keep this and gmf is 1.127 and we got to solve it using scientific calculator well uh, theta will be a uh, 4.96 degree towards port why port because the final list movement is towards port side so that is the stage one and that's the answer. Now let's talk about uh, stage two. What happened in stage two? The stage two, uh, just let's read the question again. When the derrick has swung the load 15 meter to the starboard, the derrick has swung this load to the starboard around 15 meter on this side. 15 meter uh, this side. So weight is hanging at the head itself but it has swung 15 meter to starboard we need to work out what is the list moment cause list moment caused will be 150 that is the weight into distance shifted which is 15 plus 5 that is 20 that is 3000 ton meter towards starboard why because this is the center line this was 5 meter here and it has uh, moved 15 meter this side so total distance uh, swung is uh, 20 meter so list moment causes uh, 3000 ton meter starboard however the initial list moment uh, was uh, 1076.9 initial uh, list moment 1076.9 ton meter so the final list moment in this case will be we need to subtract while well, starboard is more and the port is less so the after subtracting I get 1923.1 ton meter towards starboard if that is the case we need to understand that 10 theta again we'll use this formula final list moment is equal to W into GMF so final list moment is uh, 1923.1 WF which is the final weight uh, well it is going to remain same since weight is uh, on board ship itself into GMF and the uh, weight is hanging at the head of the derrick so the GM is uh, same as in stage 1 let me just go up stage 1 is was this 1.127 so let me just put it here 1.127 and I get this value which is uh, okay let me just punch it in the Kelsey so theta here will be 8.82 degree towards uh, starboard why starboard because the list moment caused is towards starboard side now let's discuss the stage 3 Stage 3 is we need to go up 
of what will be the list after uh, discharging the weight. So the WF will be the weight minus a small weight. So 11,000 minus 150 will give me 10850 ton. Now the list movement cost, LM cost, since weight was hanging and uh, we discharge this weight, so 150 into 15 will give you 2250 ton meter towards port. Uh, let me explain this, why we are saying. Suppose this weight has uh, uh, let me just use this color. Suppose this weight is hanging uh, like this. This weight is hanging here and it is discharged. So it will create a list moment which is W into this distance which is uh, 15. W into 15 and it will be in the opposite direction towards both side. So this is the list moment cost. However, initial list moment which is the uh, calculated in stage 2. Let's find out uh, what we had calculated in stage 2. In stage 2 this final list moment will be the uh, initial list moment for stage 3 which is 1923.1. So let me just write here 1923.1 because from stage 2 we have come to the stage 3. This is towards uh, starboard. So the final list moment in this case will be 326.9 after subtracting towards port. Now we need to work out on the GM part. If we see carefully, let me just draw this vertical line. This is K, this is uh, uh, G and this weight is discharged from this location. The weight is assumed to be acting at the head of the derrick. So what will be the value of a GG1? GG1 will be the kg and this kg of the, is of the stage 2 when the weight was hanging. First let's find out what was the kg in stage 2. Stage 2 kg in the stage 2 was same as in stage 1 and in stage 1 the kg was 6.273 so this one is 6.273 and we uh, discharge uh, something at 23 meter so w into d divided by wf so gg1 will be 150 into d d is the kg of the ship which is uh, 6.273 and the kg of the weight where the weight is acting here at the 23 meter divided by wf which is 10850 so the value of gg1 is 0 0.231 meter now if you discharge something from top this bottom becomes heavy so gg1 will come down well uh, kg1 in this case will be uh, 6. 273 minus 0 0.231 is equal to 6.042 meter. Now the KM was given and the problem which is uh, uh, 7.4 meter. KM is not changed. 7.4 meter. So the GM or new GM new GM will be 1.358 meter so again we can calculate list now 10 theta is equal to final list moment upon W into GM everything final so let's put these values so first of all the final list moment Finalist moment is 3 to 
326.9 divided by WF which is final weight and in case is 10850 10850 into GMF which is uh, 1.358 so the value of theta will be after punching will get 1.27 degree now the finalist movement is uh, towards port towards port side so this finalist will also be towards port side let's do some analysis weight Initially, the list is 4 degree towards port. However, as the weight is hanging, the list has increased from 4 degree to uh, less 4.96 degree towards port side only. Now, as the weight is hanging and, and is uh, uh, swung on the towards the starboard side, the list is changed to starboard and this list has increased to 8.82 degree towards the starboard as the weight is discharged uh, the list has become 1.27 degree from starboard again it has changed to port and that is 1.27 degree